And I went over, I guess, the 12th, 13th time to Kiev, and, uh, and I was going, supposed to announce that there was another billion-dollar loan guarantee. And I had gotten a commitment from Poroshenko and from uh, Yatsenyuk that they would take action against the state prosecutor, and they didn't. So they said they had. They were walking out to the press conference. Said, "No, nah, I said I'm not going to. We're not going to give you the billion dollars." They said, "You have no authority. You're not the president." The president said, "I said call him." <laughs> I said, "I'm telling you, you're not getting a billion dollars." I said, "You're not getting a billion. I'm going to be leaving here." And I think it was what six hours. I looked. I said, "I'm leaving in six hours. If the prosecutor's not fired, you're not getting the money." Well, son of a bitch, <laughs> got fired. And they put in place someone who was solid at the time. We spent so much time, as you know, because I went for you or to you for advice. We spent so much time on the phone making sure that everyone from, at the time, Olan to Renzi to, wouldn't walk away. They wanted no part of these sanctions on Russia. It had an impact on them. It was basically, you got to do that. And thank God Merkel was strong enough at the time to Reluctantly, she didn't like it either, 